Are you inundated with yarn, project remnants, discount bin bargains, the gifted, the thrifted and the stash of other odds and ends of unknown origins? This series aims to bust that stash with quick, simple tutorials that use only small amounts of yarn. Welcome to the Scrap Stash. Hello everyone and welcome to the first of what I hope is going to be a long running series. I'm calling it the Scrap Stash as you might have picked up on, from the intro. Uh, basically it's going to be a collection of small easy to make patterns that use up scrap yarn again you probably got that from the intro most of the patterns and tutorials i do on this channel or plan to do in the future are pretty large currently i'm working on my easy pattern if you want to see what that looks like go check out my instagram page link in the description which at this stage looks like it's going to be about five or six parts and that takes a lot of work so I'm thinking about breaking that up or supplementing it with smaller patterns sort of in between. And that's where the idea for this came about. That and I had a lot of scrap yarn lying around. Today we're going to be making uh, this little whale here, which is pretty cute if I do say so myself. And I'm going to be using up this scrap yarn I have. The purple is left over from my Espion. If you want to go see that pattern, uh, check out my Instagram. Again, link in the description and some other scrap yarn I had lying around. If you've seen any of my other tutorials, you know that I usually read out the pattern and I have the written pattern across the bottom here. The scrap stash is going to work a little bit differently. I'm going to have the crochet footage on the right hand side here and the entire written pattern is going to be on the left scrolling up the screen so i'm not going to read anything out i'm just going to have the footage on one side and the written pattern on the other the written patterns are all going to be very basic beginner friendly patterns if there's ever anything in the pattern that i think needs additional explanation i'll slow down the footage and then i'll stop and explain what or how to do something that i think is a little bit more advanced but other than that i'm just going to have footage play pattern scrolling for the entire video. This is kind of experimental at the moment, so let me know what you think of this format in the comments below, and I can change and update based on everyone's feedback. Having said all that, I think we're good to go. I hope you enjoy the very first scrap stash. The materials you'll need for this pattern are a three millimeter hook, scissors, stitch markers, a needle, pins, stuffing or polyfill, and eight ply yarn in white, black, and whatever colour you want the body of the whale to be.
Thank you for watching the first episode of The Scrap Stash. Don't forget to like and subscribe and let me know what you think. Did you like the format? Was it too fast, too slow? Uh, put all your thoughts, suggestions and anything else in the comments below and I'll see you guys next week.